welcome back to my channel. Uh, I know it's been a long time since I've actually posted anything. It's probably been a couple months uh, since I posted anything. Um, you may notice that there is a name change. I got brave enough to come out to my friends and my family about changing my name. I haven't done it legally. It's just a social thing. So all of my social media has changed. So yeah, now I'm Riley. Uh, that's kind of a scary concept. But anyways, today's video, I'm going to be doing a review. So I have some stuff here behind me. Um, I've got stuff from Dollarama, which is a big dollar store here in Canada, and I believe they have it in the States. I have Ardeen's, and Walmart, and Romwe, and some eBay. So let's jump into it, shall we? The first thing I got, it's from Romwe. So I got this pretty cool hoodie. Now I'll put it on because this thing I've been living in it. Quite literally, actually. It's very comfortable. It's the material is thin, but not in a bad way. It still keeps me warm. Now, right now I'm in Canada, so it's cold out. It's snowing somewhat this doesn't stay on the ground for long but anyways so here it is so the sleeves are pretty long like I can like send my arms out and they don't go like if I raise them over my head they just go into but and they have uh these cool stripes and it does zip up but the only irritating thing about this hoodie you, you, you see it yet there, there. there's no pockets now for me, that's very irritating because I love pockets on things, so, I mean, it's not that bad. I, I can put it on with jeans and make sure the jeans have pockets, but if I'm wearing an outfit that doesn't have pockets, it's just a tiny bit irritating. So the next thing I got that's from Romney is, where is it? I'm going to add it. These cool socks. Now... I'm not going to, I probably should have said the price of this. The hoodie's $18 on Romney, which for a hoodie is a little bit maybe absurd, but at the same time not. Um, these were about $5, and they are socks with cats. So we have a white pair with a orange tabby. We got a beige pair with a Siamese. We got a black pair with a gray tabby I guess it would be a gray tabby we got gray a pair of gray socks with black cat with pink ears which is pretty cute and we have white socks with a white cat with pink ears which is absolutely adorable so for five bucks that's not bad <laughs> I'm very happy with getting them uh, they look very well made I haven't worn them yet, just because I don't want to ruin them. Yeah, surprise, surprise. But I will eventually wear them, and I'll post pictures of that when I get down to that. So that's everything from Romney. Um, the next thing we have, I got off eBay. Good old reliable eBay. And I paid... Oh, God. Uh... I'm ashamed. $24 for this tank top. Yeah. I, I may be a little crazy. Um, but here it is. It's a black tank top. And it has Scotland written across it. I've worn this a few times. It's comfortable. Um, because I didn't wash it before wearing it, it does kind of make me itch. So I'm going to have to throw it in my washing machine before really getting any use out of it. I've just been wearing it around the house. But yeah, for, for $24 for a Scotland tank top, why not? <laughs> like, yeah. Uh, so the next thing I guess I should do is, let's see. Uh, let's do Walmart. Because good old Walmart. 
so for 10 bucks, I got a pair of leggings. And for everybody who knows me, they say, Amanda, or, well, my, yeah. Basically, before I changed my name, they were always like, Amanda, you're such a Grinch during Christmas. Why do you hate Christmas so much? Well, like, I, I just do for many reasons, personal reasons. As you can see from my backdrop, I've kind of gotten a little festive. I have little bells and I have snowflakes and LED fairy lights. Yeah, those were, by the way, from uh, the dollar store. Too. So I just decided to put it over my uh, shower curtain that's on the wall. Why not? <laughs> but anyways, Walmart, ten bucks. These adorable leggings. And they have. Let's see. What do they have on them? They got Christmas tree, presents, hot cocoa, candy cane, mittens peace symbol, stockings, a Christmas hat, mistletoe, and gingerbread men. And they're pink, so a lot of the things don't actually show up on them. Because pink and red, you know, kind of blend in together. But for 10 bucks, they're very comfortable. And I kind of, I, I have worn them already. <laughs> with a shirt that I paired, um, it's a white shirt with a cat on it, with a Christmas hat. Yeah, I may have gone just slightly a little bit overboard with Christmas, but I do it for my kids, I don't do it for myself. And the next thing I got from Walmart is this black sweatshirt, and it says, the future is bright. It's soft, I have worn it already. It's very soft inside, it's soft outside, it fits wonderfully, it's size large. Yeah, I like oversized things. <laughs> so it, it's not really oversized on me. If I wanted to oversize, I probably would have gotten an extra large, but hey, it still fits. It's still wonderful. It's so cozy. So the big haul that I decided to do and that was, the, the shirt was 15 bucks. But anyways, the, the, I spent a lot of money that I probably shouldn't have. But anyways, I went to Ardeen's. And yes, this backpack is from Ardeen's. It came with this cool key keychain. Um, originally, this backpack was $20, but it got marked down to 10 And inside, I put like a whole bunch of stuff. Um, the, it has a front pocket, so it has a front zippy pocket. But inside, I can stuff all this crap in it. Well, it's not crap, but you know what I mean. In it. So just take all that out. So inside, it has, I don't know if you can see, but it has a zipper pocket inside. It has this cool laptop pocket as well that can fit, I think it's, what does it say? can fit a 13 inch laptop. It's a 13 inch padded sleeve. And on the other side of it, there's other pockets. So there's this pocket for your phone, pocket for your keys, pocket for a pen, and it's very spacious inside. Like, so it, it's nice, it's tartan. Um, it's actually, the, I think it's the Stewart's colors, but it feels nice, it doesn't, it feels kind of well made but at the same time it's rather thin um but i'm not going to be using it for school stuff anyways i'm going to probably be using it just as a purse and with kids everything gets stuffed in your purse yeah lately i've just been having clothes with pockets and just stucking sticking everything in my pockets but can't, it's not very feasible when your kids ask you to hold stuff yeah i have that life but anyways so for for Ten buying buying it for ten bucks. That's that's not bad. And the next thing I got, now you're probably gonna say, why are you going overboard with this theme? It's Christmas. I'm Scottish. So for okay, originally these were twelve ninety, or if you want to round up, thirteen bucks. 
but I got them on sale for six. They are plaid leggings with snowflakes on them. I haven't worn them yet, the tag is still on them, but they're super soft and, you know, I buy a lot of stuff from Ardeen's because I love Ardeen's so much. <laughs> Their clothes are just awesome. Some of them don't last very long. Others things have lasted me since I was, oh God, in high school that I still have. Uh -huh. Yeah. So I got those. I also got this, I've worn this tank top already. Limited duration. I wore it for probably like a couple hours in the house. Um, it's a, oops, plaid tank top. So there's the front and there's the back. It's very soft. There is a white layer inside, so it's not like totally see-through. I mean, well, looking through it, I can see the camera or more specifically my phone, but it's very, it's kind of sheer. So you kind of have to be careful what you wear under it because as it stretches around your body, it does kind of become a little bit transparent. But with the white layer inside, it kind of helps to mitigate disasters. And for the, the last tartan themed thing, I haven't worn these yet. I actually want to because they are, look totally awesome. I got these plaid sh shoes. Now they're the same, they're kind of the same tartan as the backpack. And I got these, how much were these? These are, were originally $18 and I got them on sale for six because Ardeen's has sales that are like 70% off, 50% off, buy one, get one, 50% off, a lot of it. So yeah, these are size six, and I have shoes that are kind of like this. That they're not slip on, they're lace ups, but they're very comfortable. And I, I just, they're not always durable on the bottom, because let's face it, when you're bending down to do stuff and you bend the, the feet when it's all one and it's not very flexible rubber to begin with, yeah, you 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 kind of run into small problems. But you get what you pay for, and. They have the yoga mat inside and they're very comfortable, so why not? Cheap clothes. Okay, the next thing I got were these. So how much did I pay for these? This my main question, what is this? Oh, the slip-on sneakers I paid $9 for. Ha, huh, okay. And the leggings were 7 That's not bad. I have the, the, the invoice sheet here, so that, that I guess, helps. Um, what's this one? Eh, okay, so I got the pack of socks. These are actually panda socks, so one pair is pandas on the front. Another pair is tartan pink plaid with black on the bottom, and then the other one is this kind of gray with kind of wintery patterns on it and they were seven dollars but they're crew socks there's three pairs and for that price I mean yeah probably at Walmart I could get them 10 bucks for a pack at 10 or 20 but whatever I mean they don't have they're, they're super cute and I have socks from Ardeans already so and I know they're comfortable and who can resist the panda the panda I mean, my nickname growing up from one of my uncles was always Panda, so that kind of brings back memories. The other thing I got were these for $5. They're called iPhone gloves. I have no idea if these are actually going to work or not, but uh, we got yellow with pink stripe, black with white stripe, which will go with the hoodie pretty nicely. And we got pink with black stripes. And they have the, I guess because they're iPhone gloves, they have the magic finger thing, but I don't know if they actually work. I've never had a pair of these. I usually just stick my hands in my pockets when I'm going outside. I don't usually wear gloves or mittens. 
So it'll be a cool test to see if they actually work or not. I don't know. We'll see. The next thing I got were... If it showed here. There it is. I had to go through my, my little pile here. I paid... What is it? Er, Ten bucks for this. It's a black slip-on bodysuit. I haven't worn this yet. I haven't tried it on. Um, I used to have one of these for dance. They mean slip on, but I actually slip on. I guess I could wear this under... I mean, I wouldn't wear this without underwear on, that's for sure. Um, but I used to wear one of these for when I went to dance class. So, and I grew out of it. So getting a new one was kind of a big deal for me because I was like, I want to get back into doing that kind of stuff. So I got it and hope it'll work. Yeah, I, I kind of do stuff weirdly. But for 10 bucks, bodysuit, money. And I got these. These were the, no, these weren't, these were the second most expensive thing to buy. These are leggings that are $20 better than the $60 I paid for other ones that have them. These are leggings. Okay, they're leggings. They're they're black leggings. You think they're plain? No, they're not. Because they got pockets. I can stick my wallet in them. I can stick my phone in them. I can stick my keys in them. I have other pairs of leggings that are that have these um, from Pop Fit. I have two pairs of those that have pockets. Shambhala has pockets. You see the theme here. But anyways, these are the Ardeen's Eco Collection. So they're made with recycled plastic bottles, which I think is totally awesome. They are super comfortable. The fab You think the fabric would be shit, but it's actually not. They're nice. I have worn these. They are super comfortable. They feel like you're not wearing anything, quite literally. And I have other leggings where you wear them and they're like, oh my god, they're just like so tight. You know you're wearing pants. But these, these are light. I haven't tested them going outside yet. I'm not brave enough for that yet uh, because it's so cold out. But I got I got leggings with pockets, and cheaper than other leggings with pockets I've bought, which I am ashamed to admit. But they're they're very comfortable. They're very flexible. They're very nice. I I love Ardeen's. They're I didn't even know these existed until I was on the site. I was like, oh cool, they have an eco collection. What's that? Click. They have a whole list of stuff. And it's made out of recycled plastic bottles. Or bamboo. Some of them are is made out, uh, made out of bamboo. And I was like, okay, cool. Environment friendly. And the last, but not least, the most most expensive thing from our deans that I bought that make me itch uncontrollably because I have not washed them yet but I have worn them a few times around the house they are these denim joggers so here's the leg and here's the waist and the best thing is you think these are fake no real pockets real pockets i know it's amazing the things i find now when i did get these they the pockets were sewn shut but they are fully functional pockets you just have to take a seam ripper and rip them open where they've sewn them shut um it's mostly to protect from bulging and to keep people from in the store uh, ripping them so i totally get that but anyways these are in a size large we have a theme here. Size large is, well, yeah, uh, that's kind of my size at the moment. But they have this cool jawstring, which I use because these are even as a large, they're big, pretty big on me. But they stretch still, and they're very comfortable, even though they make me itch, um, just because I haven't washed them yet. So, you know, they came out of the warehouse because I had them shipped online. But I don't, I, I guess I should have known. It wasn't until my husband stated that you should wash clothes 
before you wear them. I didn't know that growing up. Growing up, it was like, oh, we bought you new clothes. Go put them on. Wear them for the day. That's just how it was. We didn't do the wash them before you wear them. But anyways, now on to the most expensive thing. I spent $100 at Dollarama. I know, shocking. Now, most of that was on craft stuff that I bought because I wanted to do craft stuff with kids, which some of it flopped, unfortunately. But we have some cool stuff here. So let's get into it. Now, I've worn these once. <laughs> they do have pockets. They are a size... I don't even know what size these are. Extra large. They're extra large. They're pink, plaid, flannel, pants. Now, these are huge on me. They don't fit me correctly. They don't fit me right in any shape, way, or form. They're just huge. Like, they're super long. They're, the, the waist does, doesn't sit right. The pockets don't sit right. It's just, I mean, I, I paid $4 for them. I mean, I guess you get what you're paying for. They're, they're so thin, too. They don't keep you warm. They're just, they're, they're a disaster. But when you wake up in the morning and you're like, oh, I gotta roll out of bed and go walk the dog. They're the quick and easiest thing to grab. Just throw them on, stick your keys in your pocket, and just go quickly to run the dog outside. That's basically all they're good for. You can't wear them anywhere else, and they're not really comfortable to wear around the house. Just They're just... A disaster. That, that's all I'm gonna say. Four bucks. Whatever. Next thing I got. Now I was gonna pair these with the leggings. I don't know how I'm gonna do that. But it says a red it's a red shirt in a large size large and it says kiss me. And I it in the kiss me it is played. So I make pair this with the plaid with snowflakes leggings or I may pair them with black jeans I don't know yet but I paid four dollars for this too it's pretty cute kiss me under the mistletoe picture here with snowflakes I thought it was pretty cute next we have what is this I'm the reason Santa has a naughty list It's a metal cup, paid $3 for it. I uh, haven't used it yet. Um, it pre seems pretty well made for a dollar store cup. I don't know how it's gonna do for heating. Like if I have a hot drink, if it's gonna burn me or not. It might, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, do not microwave, do not dishwash. Hey, okay. So on the bottom it says don't throw it in the dishwasher and whatever you do, don't microwave it. And being something made out of metal, yeah, you really don't want to throw this in the microwave. You may you might have to uh, evacuate your house if you throw this in the microwave. But anyways, on to the next thing. The next thing, what do we have? We have a knit True North 100% acrylic plaid hat. I haven't worn it yet. It I paid three fifty for it. Yeah, I guess I could try it on. <laughs> Nothing too spectacular. I mean, it kind of. Yeah, it doesn't really. It feels weird. I don't wear hats normally. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, no. I don't wear hats. I don't like hats. I like hoods. Um. I mean, I guess I could just roll it. Maybe I don't know. It kind of fits, it sits weird because I have a ponytail in, but at the same time, it's like every time I move my head, it, like, feels like it's going to pull off my head. So, mm. it's cute. I got it. It's warm. Should keep me warm, maybe, if I wear it. What else do I have? Oh, I have these gloves. Funny story, I bought those ones from our jeans with the touch, because I didn't believe that they had touch, but... These are three in one, so I can wear them with the black over top, or I can wear them just with the pink, or I can wear them just with the black with cut off fingers. They're 
magic three in one gloves. That's that's all they are. You just wear them three different ways. <laughs> Which, you know, I, I would probably just wear the black with the pink stripes anyways. Because having your fingers free is useful when you're gripping stuff. But I guess for wearing two gloves at the same time for warmth, which make, would probably make more sense. Anyways. Next, what do we have? What do we have? What's that? Oh, that's musky boot. We don't want musky boot. What's this? There we go. Okay. We have a LED easy read light that clips onto your glasses. I paid three bucks for this, I think. I don't know. Do I have a receipt? Yes, I do. Ha ha ha. I have no idea what I paid for. It doesn't tell me. How about that? Okay. Yeah, probably three bucks. I have no idea. I really don't. It doesn't really tell me. Uh, a lot of things that are on this list that I spent a hundred bucks is craft stuff. Most of it's craft stuff. Most of it is some of it's Christmas gifts. Some of it's other. That doesn't help me at all. But anyways, three bucks for a light that clips onto your glasses. You can read with them. You can... I mostly got them to go under my computer desk when my computer's having issues to fix it. Which, because holding your phone as a flashlight doesn't work when you're trying to fix a computer. I got one for my husband as well. Because he's a computer programmer and he spends most of his time fixing computers. Useful little gadget. Don't know how well it's going to work. Don't know how well it's going to hold up. But, three bucks. Can't be beat. Next, we have these weird hair ties. That's a knot. And they're stretchy. They're elastic. They're Christmas colors. Uh, what? 125. So, got these. They're pretty cool. Um, yeah. I haven't worn them yet. I, I don't know when I'm gonna wear them. I'll probably wear them for Christmas, but that's about it. Uh, I'll probably wear the black one more often than not. Maybe. I don't know. I don't like how it knots like that, but I mean, I thought they were pretty cool because I've never seen elastic bands like this for hair. So for twenty five. Next piece. What's on my list? Oh, those are the kids' mittens. Yeah, I got, I got True North fleecy kind of mittens for my oldest son because he keeps losing his mittens. So I got $2 black mittens for him. Um, oh, another thing that I found at the dollar store. Now these were two bucks, I think. I think, no, $1.50. So close enough to two bucks. They're Paw Patrol candy canes. Now, you can't see the individual pups that, that's on them, because it's... Well, maybe you can. I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know. But, they're Paw Patrol. For fifty candy canes for the kids. Something fun. Oh, they have all the pups on each one. Okay. But they're just really, really tiny. <laughs> fun. What else did I get? Oh! I got a power bank I spent four dollars on. It's a battery power bank from the dollar store. I don't know how well it's gonna work. I've never used it before. I have I've never used a power bank for a phone or for any device that I own. Mostly because I just plug it into a wall. But I guess if you have a power outage or something like that, I guess the power bank would be pretty good useful to have. So I got one in purple. I also got This hairbrush. Now, I don't know how well it's going to work. It's wood handled. has real wood. Wood bristles. It feels like, I think they're real wood. But it's like a squishy plastic thing that's holding them in. And I paid $4 for it. I haven't used it as of yet. I'll use it eventually. Um, I'll probably throw it in my backpack purse. But 
you know, I, I've heard that wood is good for using on your hair and not plastic because of tangles or whatever, but I haven't used it. We'll see. I hope it works. Or else it'll be dead. Um, I got, oh yes, I got these $2 knee-high cute penguin socks. Yes, the penguin. My husband loves penguins. So I got penguin socks because I was like, oh, cool, they have penguins. I know my husband will never wear them, but I can wear them around him. So I got cute $4 penguin socks. And to go with the penguin theme, I've worn these a hell of a lot. Penguin slippers. And they have like the, the sticky kind of things on the bottom. And I think they were like $4 as well. But for for penguin socks, they're penguin slippers. They're they're cute and they have like the the furry inside. And last but not least of what I've got, I got this cute unicorn wallet. And oh my god, yeah. So it has these cute tiny unicorns on it, and inside it has this zipper pouch. I guess for coins or whatever, but I would put other things in there. Probably the kids' health cards or whatever in there. Um, now, there is a pocket that's, I guess, meant for money, but my phone actually fits in it. I can't show you because I'm using it as a camera right now. But um, you can, like... Oh, there's other pockets in here. I didn't notice. There. Okay. I can use this as technically as a purse. I can't put my keys or whatever in it, but... I can put all, it look, I can fit all my cards in. I, there's other pockets for cash. There's, wow, this thing is actually very roomy. <laughs> cool, okay. So I could stick like all my cards in. I can stick this, that, and next thing. That's pretty cool. And for, I think it was $3. Is it $3? $4. It's $4. I found the tag inside. $4 for a cute unicorn wallet why not i mean it's cute it's versatile yeah so that's everything that i've got um i do have more stuff coming in the mail but that's for a later video um links for ardeans will be in the description box i couldn't give get you links for walmart or for the dollar store stuff because I just walked into the store and got it. I didn't order online. But everything that I did get online, I'll put the links for. Um, as always, like, subscribe, share. Be everything you want to be. Be fabulous. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.